Hi, this is Deb from Business Building Shortcuts, and today we're going to go grab you a free HTML editor that you can use to make web pages, whether they are squeeze pages, landing pages, informational pages, um, that you can use for complex or simple pages. And so we're going to go and get Composer, K-O-M-P-O-Z-E-R, which is a version of NVU. So go ahead and put that into your search box and click search and you'll come to this page and then all you need to do is to click on Composer Easy Web Authoring and it will take you to the Composer page and you can see here that it is you can use it with your Windows machine Macintosh or Linux and I want you to click on download and you will see the latest stable versions and you would choose your operating system since I'm Windows I'm going to click here on Composer and you can see here where it says download Composer for Windows it has detected my operating system and is choosing the right option for me so I'm going to click that and it's going to bring me to SourceForge which is a great place to get open source software right now this is the only thing we want so I want to go ahead and save the file and it's going to let me browse to where I want to save it and in this case I'm going to save it to my desktop so I'm going to click Save, and then what I'm going to do is to, um, see I've already got it on my desktop, so what you would want to do is navigate to it, right click on that, and unzip this zip file, extract all, and then go in and double click on the exe file, and um, you will be able to open it at that point. So click Save, and download this to your computer. After you have extracted the file, um, you can see here it's going to give you a folder with the information in it. Double click on that folder. See where, where it says composer.exe? All you need to do is double click on that icon and it's going to ask you if you want to run it. And uh, we do. And so click run. And composer will open a brand new window and here is where you will be able to um, look at the website you're creating you can actually type in here or you can look at the actual source code that lives behind um, your web pages and you can see here it's got the body HTML code and body and what you've typed is right there. So what WYSIWYG means is that you can create what you want in this box that shows exactly what it's going to look like and for the most part everything you do can be done in that one particular spot. So what we would do is to um, create a, a particular web page and then go ahead and save it as um, an HTML file, upload that to your web hosting company to your website and it would become live on your screen. But what we want to do with this right now um, is just to set it aside but you've got it on your computer and we're going to be showing you a variety of things how to set up and test your links for your kickstart cart products we're going to use it for um, doing some squeeze page template work later on but for right now uh, you've got it right where you want it and so you can just go ahead and click this to close your composer. There's one more thing you might want to do and that is see where this little icon is? If you right click that you can create a shortcut and then you can drag that shortcut to your desktop and you would be able to click on it from your desktop instead of going into your program file and I've already got one in there so it's asking me if I want to exchange it and I don't because I already have a desk uh, an icon on my desktop so if that you found this video helpful come on over to businessbuildingshortcuts.com and where we have more videos and other kinds of tools and techniques to help your business hit the ground running I hope you're having a great day bye bye